So I'm going to talk about one of the greatest feature you would have ever come across in our country. It's called my stockage. Now, what is my stockage? My stockage is essentially the section which is owned by you and everything which is related to you. Because you as an individual, you would like to track the market, find out opportunities, know the relevant section of the market based on your preferences, based on your understanding of the market, right? Now, watch list, as you know, is a group of stocks you want to watch, right? Now, inevitably, we know that we have various category of stocks which can be tracked. So we like to track FMCG sector in a different manner. We like to track the IT sector in a different manner. So you can have different objectives of tracking the group of stocks. So what we have done is we have given you my watch list where you can create multiple watch lists and you can add multiple stocks in those watch lists and you can track all the stocks at a consolidated level, right? And you can see various parameters on the basis of which the stock can be exhaustively covered, right? Similar to this, there's something called uh, my investor group. What we have done is we have created a proprietary method of giving you a group creation facility where you create a group and you add respective investor name as part of the group and track a stock on a consolidated basis in that particular in that particular section or in that particular group right the third one which is again very interesting is called my scans now my scans gives you an opportunity to scan to to track scans which are favorite which are favorite scans which are it scans which you would like to track effectively so if you go to that particular my scan page and if you track the stocks you can get the filter stocks you can actually see the condition getting satisfied in those stocks. You can actually classify those conditions based on NSC major, NSC FO. Again, you have something called my target. Now you have given targets to various stocks. Now this section exhaustively pens down all the targets which you have given in multiple stocks. Also, it will give you historically which stock has recently achieved the target so that in case you want to act further on that historical data, you can do it from this particular section.